Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Violet. In the last part, we took on another gym. We took on the, uh... A very fun gym. I like that gym. The, the electric gym. We took on Ayano. Then we headed out to take on the next Titan, which is, which is the giant earthworm. Now we are getting running ready to take on the next, uh... Team Star. So, the goal here is to probably knock out these two. Then, probably go back over here and knock out this gym if I have to still have time. So, let us go knock some uh, knock some heads. He's the poison, so. Espeon would be... well... That's not what I wanted. Um... No! I'll put you there. There's a heat rock! on oh hey man Cecil hey there Clive glad to see you got my name committed to memory now let's pick up our conversation from where we left up before as mentioned I have joined Operation Starfall to resolve a sticky situation to find out the reasons behind Team Star's odd behavior above all I wanted to know why the students in Team Star have stopped coming to school and, just like Castle Cassiopeia, I want the team to disband for good. Since joining Operation Starfall with you, I've already had some success in opening up a dialogue with Team Star. And I think I'm starting to understand things more clearly. But I don't have enough information just yet. That's why I want to speak with students from Team Star and other squads as well. If you intend to take on another base, know that you can count on me for backup. Till then, see you around, Cecil. Backup? What the fuck are you gonna do? Nothing. Simeon. I think this is the version exclusive for uh, Violet. Do me a favor and go home already, will ya? No, I want to see the boss of the Navi squad. Take me to Dawn Atticus. Like I said, kid the boss told me not to let any outsiders pass these gates. That includes you. I don't care. I'm not leaving until you let me talk to Dawn Atticus. Give me a break, little doofus. Oh boy. Huh? Oh great, here comes another rando to ruin my day. I didn't think any grunt work for Team Star Newbies would be this much of a chore. Hold on, Mr. Karan, I think this girl might be Cecila. Wait, Cecila? That kid who picked the fight with Team Star? Prepare to be raided. I knew it! Oh boy, this ain't good. Everyone else in the basin is still asleep since we were up all busting and playing video games. Leave it to me, Mr. Karan. I'll buy some time for you to wake up the others. Yeah, and what's in it for you? Don't let I guess we'll be in danger if no one's right here to defend the base. I owe that man my life. He's my dear com com compadre. When crisis calls, one has no choice but to rally those who are dear to him, no matter the cost. Yeah, I have no idea what you're on about, kid. But thanks for the big assist. Alright, you villain. You figure out the Don Attic is prepared to face my wrath. Kid, you have no idea. You're way over your head with this. Yusef. You're gulping. I'm not afraid of your gulping. Mm. Drown it, drown it in water. Shrotel.
I talk big, but I'm no warrior. Clearly you're not. I take your money though. Thanks. I stole your lunch money. Don Atticus. Sorry, I failed you. Cecil, are you all right? I was standing watch when I heard a ruckus all of a sudden. I got word that maybe something hadn't happened to you over here. Uh, no fair, you had back up this whole time. Is this boy one of the Academy students? He doesn't look like he's from Team Star. You're right, I'm not a member of Team Star, but Don Anakis is my compadre. I have to see him no matter what. Well, clearly you have your reasons for being here. Cecil, I'd like to ask this boy some questions. You go ahead and get started on the base. I'm gonna borrow one of you for a chat, my, uh, my man. Don't worry, I won't bite. Hope not. Nice work dealing with the guard. It wasn't much of a guard, it's more like annoyance. Within that base size team stars Poison Crew and the Navi Squad. Their boss, Atticus, designs the outfits for the team. You can say he has clever hands. The guy's also a bit of an eccentric. You can never tell what he's going to do next. So, since it's beyond us to predict how he'll respond to our declaration of war, just take out as many squads Pokemon as you can until Atticus shows his face. Alright. I can do it. I know that. I know. I know the deal. Ring a ding ding coming through. Okay. It seems the folks behind the scene. The Operation Star 4 are finally making them move against our base. You know what that means? Game time for us to shine bright and adventure teammates. And hey, little insured, so you know. Okay, I don't. I've already seen. Alright, Vaporian's ready to go. Go. This guy got a Haunter and no, no Gengar? That's not gonna be good for uh, Zolti on here. Where are you going? You're going the wrong way. Any more more Pokemans? She's way above our level. Yep. Don't fuck with me. Alright. Atticus. Looks like you're taking, taking some lessons from Koga from Kanto. Pray forgive my sudden entry. Tis I, Atticus. You're that scoundrel Cecil, I take it. You have some nerve bearing your fangs on Team Star. Come then, villainous wretch, a plunge into the grim poison shall be your well deserved fate. 
Alright. Up on punch and awaits the ratchet plague on, my, on your house. Well then. You would do that to me. Got dental shock. That's bad for me because that deals more damage if it's, if it's on poisons. She's sitting on a, an actual river room, not using your stupid car, huh? All right. You give me a taste of power, mine own poison. Fee! Fee! Alright. <laughs> God damn, with those those torque abilities deal a lot of damage. Wow, that shit all. Ha! Thank you! But, uh, if I, he does it again, it's gonna probably kill me, so... Yep. Oh, no, I'm still alive! Fuck you! Of course, it doesn't affect him. Naturally. Alright. to bits. Alright. How much is this deal? God, it hurts so much. I'm not the same. Toxic spikes? Oh, shit. John's hanging in there. A champ. I'm all in it. I'm all in it for Jolteon because Jolteon's hanging in there. I'm all in. 
Plus those talk spikes are gonna fuck me. Are you out of not just torque? I'm running out of these. Oh, never mind. He still has them. Ha! Got two more of these. Jolteon can't be stopped. All right, well, I'll be playing the whittle, not the the slow game at that point, so. I probably could have just switch, switch to Espeon and end this whole fight ages ago. Alright. Yeah, there's the talk to spikes. I don't know if I'll be able to get a hidden. Hopefully, hopefully I'm faster. Of course not. Espeon, no, I tried! Those toxic spikes fucked me. If you weren't for those that, that damn poison, then you could have survived that hit. Alright. You know what? Fuck you. Flareon. Get out of here. Your oversized, glamorous car. Give me my friends. Alright. Forgive me. It took goodly time to procure the required materials. Whoa, sick. Those boots are insane. Ah, yeah. The move flame charge was my muse for those, part for those particular pieces. Those are very terrible boots. I don't know how you can move in those. This outfit has everything I'd imagine it would be. Thank you so much. You know, if it weren't for that mask, then you, you might actually look good. If you get the take that mask off, I'd be able to see your face. I'm going to wish to create a costume worthy of, of the great infernal Eerie. Eerie? And if it aligns with your vision, then I am content. Seems our outfit upgrades are all wrapped up. Thanks a ton, Atticus. You two looking like absolute beasts. No one, anyone who crosses us will be sweating bullets. You're so good at these th these sorts of crafty things, Atticus. Those people bullying you, those people bullying you because you geek out or old-fashioned stuff are out of their minds. The way the, the way the ninja is rough and fraught with thorns, I never neither expect nor desire sympathy from the unrefined rabble. Oh, someone's getting all fired up! Watch out, world! Our Atticus is fighting words. Yeah, don't listen to the haters, Atticus. I think you're really cool. Anyway, gang, let's move on to the next step. It's time to put our backs into bat our battle chain so we're all prepped for Operation Star. You gotta be stronger than anyone else in the team. That's what being a boss means. Indeed it does. Henceforth, I will devote myself to heart and soul to honing my battle skills. For the sake of the team, I would give them give my very soul, heart and soul. But I cannot defy the rules. Our code must be obeyed. And so, this badge is mine to keep no more. I trust it to thy, ca thy care. He's got the honorable bow. He's honorable, at least. He's a ninja. Take this contraption too. Take contains a technique that allows one to cover their foes in gunk. Oh, good, wonderful. Sasso is thy name, is it not? 
You have utterly bested me, but thy victory stirred no bitterness within me. Such was its brilliance. Don Atticus! My compadre? See, this little fellow has been dying to speak with you face to face. Don Atticus, please hear what I have to say. I don't need a moment. Whatever brought you all the way here. I came to help you. If you don't start going to class again, you'll be expelled from the academy, right? When the other kids in school and I were getting bullied, Bill Bad, you and the rest of Team Star saved us. Thanks to that operation you carried out, we were all good to able to go to school again. If you got expelled for being the good guys, that'd be the worst thing ever. Forgive me. Have you heard anything from the big boss? Nay, we haven't heard not a whisper since that fateful day. Without the big boss, Team Star cannot carry on. And without the team, the bright and merry student life we seek lies beyond our reach. We have no choice but to defend our base until the big boss returns to us. You evidently trust this big boss here is a great deal. Who exactly are they? In truth, none of us have met them in the flesh. By their own word, they are recluse. As with the rest of us, it would seem bullying was to blame. That's awful. Though their name and face be unknown to us, they are nonetheless our precious comrade. Not only trust is to maintain our virg vig virgils. vigils from the bases and wait the day that they return. So that's why you don't go to school. But but still, don't ever think that Team Star is all you have, Don Atticus. You got a lifelong compadre in me, and don't you forget it. My compadre. I owe you a great debt. It seems we're one step closer to, to the truth behind the Team Star's truancy and the bullying of the Academy. But more importantly, I can't believe I had no idea about these issues the students are struggling with. They have friendships they hold dear and reasons for acting as they do. I just couldn't see it. It's shameful how oblivious I've been. Ah, uh, I believe Team Star to be the one and only treasure in my life. He thinks I've been mistaken. I'm getting to suspect the identity of the real of uh, this big boss is. I'm getting to suspect. Tesla, it's me. Ah, I guess the star badge is not yours then. I see. Now that the boss has been taken down, the Navi squad's days are numbered. Now Atticus too. Sorry, I got a lot on my mind right now. So Operation Starfall. You've taken down all but two bases, so it's fair to say it's going well. This seems like a good time to let you know what we're ultimately aiming to achieve. Our final goal. Is to defeat the Massman that first recruited the five squad meant bosses and created Team Star, the one they call the Big Boss. Who is this Big Boss? Who knows? They control the five squads from the shadows. That's all anyone could say. If we defeat the first person and get them to declare the team disbanded, then it'll be it for Team Star. Since the Big Boss never sets up, set up his, their own base and keeps their identity hidden, I take it they're not one for the spotlight. But once the squad bosses are all out of action, the bo Big Boss will finally have to take the stage. Now about your war, I'll transfer some LP to over your phone as promised. Oh boy! You know those LPs! And more TMs along with it. Every Pokemon learns strong moves so you can continue to be used to the operation. My supply unit or should be with you soon. Hey there, Setsla. That, uh, sounded like a pretty serious phone call. No, I wasn't talking to you. Oh boy. No, he's doing it again. Poor girl. He's just so excited, apparently, for some reason. I don't know why. So that Mansman you were talking about, Cassio Perez mentioned him to me too. It's Team Star's founder, the person who's caused all kinds of misery at the Academy. If you don't take them down, I'll lose what I treasure uh, what I treasure the most in the world. What do you mean? Uh, no, I just... Um, that's right, you need your reward! Here, take it before I forget. She's hiding something from me. Alright, well, I'll be off then. Oh, and Cecila? Don't lose those guys. She's hiding something from me. All right, that one's down. So uh, let's just make a beeline. Oh, 
Wait, how am I supposed to get there? Uh, how do I get there? There's really no good way to get there. Looks like I can't swim because looks like it's not. Uh, how do I get there? Hmm, maybe there's a cave or something? Maybe I have to climb the mountain and go down that way? No, that wouldn't make sense though. How do I get over there? Maybe I can't get there yet. Of course, there's always a pot. There's always a pot. Oh. Mm. Well, let me just see what's over here. Maybe there's a cave or something like right around here. Maybe. I'll go there and look for a cave. I know there's new po there's a, there's a couple new Pokemans here, but uh, I'm gonna save it for them for later. Uh, is that a town? What is that? Where's the map? Oh, here we go. Big mountain. Maybe there's a cave I can go through. There's a Mimikyu. What's this? I don't see hard dropouts. Uh, okay. A sporty cat. Alright, well, you're not anyone who I'm looking for. Oh, fuck me. Oh, yeah, I got rid of poison. Poison heals or anti- oh, I do. So nice to be able to auto heal. Um. So it's just a big mountain blocking my way. Maybe I can't get here from this side. What is that? Oh, I'll be back later for it. I'm trying to figure out how to get over there. Uh... Um, that's way up top. 
Oh, okay, so maybe there's not a cave for me to go through because that's way the fuck up. Oh shit Fucking vacuum cleaner I don't have you. Oh, never mind. I do Yeah, that's like way way the fuck up So looks like I can't get over there from here So maybe I have to go through the mountain And go through there to get over there because uh Yeah, it's 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 just a sheer cliff. So I don't think there's a cave What is this military installation over here? What is this? What is this? I'm stuck. What am I stuck on? I'm stuck on nothing. Oh, there's a gimme ghoul. Or, uh, gimme get. Oh, what the fuck this thing is. Yeah, it's just a sheer cliff. So maybe I can't get there to this side. So that being the case, uh, I guess I'm gonna go back in this direction. So I guess I'm gonna go straight over here. Take on the next gym. The closest way I can get to is from there, so... Well, yeah, actually, no, this is the closest because I'd have to go through the desert. How many battles have I fought here? One. Great. No, 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 no. All right.
All right, Medali. Let's take on the next gym. Uh, this is normal, which is weird seeing a normal type gym, you know. Uh, I guess it doesn't matter who I use. I don't think Umbreon would be good against that. Let me see here. I don't think Dark is very, is very effective against Normal. Oh yeah, all my terror types are Normal. Huh. It's fine. Let's give uh, let's give you some time to shine. Oh, it's Nimona, she's here. I saw you going to the gym and I came running. Listen, I'm really sorry I couldn't battle you the last time we ran into each other. Wait, don't get me wrong. I didn't chase you out down just to battle you. And again, I guess I wouldn't mind a battle or anything if you wanted to. What do you say? Sure. Yes, battle time! You and me, Cecil. Wait, hold on. I want to be sure to pick the right Pokemon for where, for where you're at in your journey. Sorry, give me a sec to find to my team. Then we can battle. Back while you're waiting, go ahead and take on, take on the gym. Alright. Alright. Register me up, sir. Okay, gym test, blah blah blah. You're the Medallia gym, that means ordering a special secret. What the fuck is that supposed to mean? Specifically, menu at the Treasury Eatery, a much loved restaurant here in Medallia. Order correctly and you pass! Right now there are three other challenges out around town attempting this gym challenge gym test. Each challenge has been given a different clue that will help them discover their secret dish. You'll be given a clue as well. Please find and battle the other challengers. The loser must tell the winner their, their clue. Your goal is to gather clues and use them to determine the secret dish, then order it from the waiter at the treasure eatery. Only the challenger who is able to order correctly will pass the test. Your clue is to find out how the regulars season their dishes. I suggest you start by hearing what the reg what a regular at the treasure eatery has to say. Oh, all right, a bit of a puzzle here, huh? Actually, making me think this time. All right. Uh... Do you have a clue about the secret dish? Like I said, better beat you, beat you, and learn it. So I gotta be able to defeat three of these trainers, huh? Alright. I had a better fairy move for you, like Moonblast or something. Even Dazzling Gleam would be up, up like. I can't believe this gym test makes us steal each other's clues. That's fucking dirty. All right, okay, so what's my clue? My clue I was going to was look for a dark spot surrounded by stairs. I don't remember seeing any particular dark spots in this town. This dark spot? Very suspicious, if you ask me. Some faint writing here. Fire blast. All right. 
Jesus Christ, look at this place. It's huge. What's up, buddy? God damn. This is a big ass restaurant. Then it's a lot bigger than it is in the out than on the uh, outside. Jesus Christ. Oh, I can't even get up here. Are you regular here? Yeah, I said spell that dude come here often. Must be a gym test challenger. This is tip for you. An easy squeeze of lemon gives any dish a refreshing kick. So lemon, fire blast, I've seen fire blast is the is the is what I'm looking for. the gym test right tell me a clue about the secret dish no yeah but you tell me yours because i'm gonna beat it out of you i don't care if you're a kid oh okay never mind that's kind of bad thing to say Couldn't kill yourself. Reason. The evolved form of the squirrel, of the chipmunk. The squirrel. I did shit all damage. All right. Okay. Let's, uh, let's go to you. Eventually. Ha! Karma's a bitch. Let's just say that was entirely planned. And I confuse you too. Ha <laughs> ha! Hit yourself. Ha <laughs> ha! I'll take that. If you can't hit yourself, you can't move. Kill myself. No, oh, I can't move. Never mind. You would. All right, Espion. I know you can pull through. This oversized squirrel out of my face. Fat squirrel. Clothes look for something that's odd, as that's the odd one out of one of the ice cream stands. Odd one out, one of the ice cream stands. What? Well, since I'm here, I might as well heal up. Umbreon some love and love here. 
I haven't shown up. I haven't shown up on Brownie yet. Audible now at one of the ice cream stands. That's crepes. I don't put it out in one of the ice cream stands. What? I mean, that'll be you because you're not an ice cream stand. Is there more? There's still one more challenger though, so here's more. Mm. Leftovers. Oh, it's skewer. I don't see anything out of the ordinary. First turn wake, huh? Great. your clue yes you do give me your clue while I figure out the other one uh, listen closely to the bluebird Pokemon what the fuck bluebird Pokemon what bluebird Pokemon Alright, so, so I guess I'll find something about an ice cream stand and a bluebird Pokemon. You're a churro. Be looking talk. All right, what do you guys say? 
Isn't he just a cute? So say, and then they say nothing. No think. Medium. I get it. Medium. So fire blast. Medium. And lemon. Uh, let me see if that narrows down my options. Assuming Fire Blast is still the, uh... We'll take your order. Alright. Uh... What would we be ordering? Oh, fuck me. Well, if it's medium, maybe steak? Right now. Well, never mind. That's me. Okay, that's this is the medium. I already fucked it up. Fire blast style. Lemon. Uh, it's taking a shot in the dark in that first one. Damn. All right. So my not, my options are still pretty wide open. So odd one out at the ice cream stand. Are you, are you talking about the actual stands themselves? Because that's ice cream. Okay, so it's gotta be you. But you can. You have craps though. Is that an option? Because, uh, your ice cream too. It's gotta be that one. Hmm. Was there even a crap option available? balls medium fire blast lemon oh was that it gotcha beating rice balls extra crispy with lemon oh was that it oh fuck where'd the people go Congratulations, you passed the gym test. That was kind of interesting. It actually made you think a little bit. Uh-huh. Those last two gym tests were pretty pretty uh pretty good. I'm ready to go. Larry, you're up! Oh, this man, I knew he stood out. Hello. I'm Larry, I'm assigned to work as a gym leader at the Medelli Gym. Good job make, for making your way through the gym test. And well, maybe try the other dishes on the, main, on the menu too sometime. Everything's good here. Anyway, my boss would dock my pay if I spend too much chit chatting. Let's get this battle over with. Alright, Mr. Office Man. Thank you for doing business with us today. I, Larry, will be at your service. I guess it's not all that strange that there's a normal gym type, because wasn't there a normal gym type in, uh, in the Hoenn games?
but you would do that to me. Oh my god. Alright, I am just gonna... I'm gonna get another uh, assurance off of you. Then, uh, get you out. Um... Jesus Christ, that slam? Fuck. Get out of here. That slam took me down less than half. The Dunsparce? What? Dunsparce has an evolution? I gotta see this shit. Not with you, though. Vaporeon. The Dunsparce? What? I gotta see this. It's just a bigger Dunsparce! What? What's the difference? It's just a bigger Dunsparce! Of course I'm paralyzed. Bitch. Of course I'm paralyzed, naturally. I mean, that hyper gel is gonna just destroy it. Destroy my health, so I'm always just stay in. Doesn't matter if I try to heal through that. One shot, I'll be back, back down below. Sending out Jolteon because if he's gonna tear us, if he's gonna tear us to I mean, he's not gonna be a flying type when he, when he does it. So, this is still better than getting cornered by my boss. That's fine. He doesn't specialize in spe an attack anyway. Both normal types. Pretty good. Why am I losing this? Come on, Larry, step it up a notch. Mm. All right. Oh, we're getting tracked in the crowd now. All right, Larry. Come on, guy. You need some you need some energy. Well, you heard the good folks. I suppose I can put out a bit, bit more of a show. All right.
think it's time to show you that real life isn't being true to once to sell. Facade. Oops. Oh, of course you get a critical on me. Saw it hit so hard. Get out of here. So it threw me for a loop. I did. I'm pretty good. You're rather strong, strong, aren't you? Not to bring out my poker face, even. I lost, so that means I have to give you a badge, but... You're hungry, aren't you? That battle made me a bit hungry. Care to join me for a meal? Sure. Jesus Christ, man! How many rice balls are you gonna eat? Having five gym badges in the hand makes it easy to catch a Pokemon with the level 45. Oh, and they all lack, they'll actually listen to you, too. This is for you. Though hopefully a child like you has no put no need to put it to on, put on its namesake. Facade. Mood power is double if the user is poisoned, burned, or paralyzed. That's pretty good. Just here, we've all got flavor. Good flavor, I mean. Oh, don't worry about the bill. I do earn a much salary, after all. No, I better get back to work. If you'll excuse me. All right, man. That was exciting. Oh, hey, another gym bat leader defeated. Well done. We can inform you that there was, there was an unusual trainer worth of keeping an eye on. Since she met you, I guess I guess as much. I had the pleasure of observing your last match. I was impressed by that fantastic skill you showed. Managed to keep the momentum and achieve champion rank. I'll be very interested in inviting you to the Pokemon League and. Hey, hey, Cecil, I've got my team all put up, picked out. Please, let me heal first. And I saw you battling the gym leader. You just keep getting better. I'm oh, good to see you again, champion Nimona. It's certainly been a while. Whoa, wait. La Prim. La, Pri La, La Primera? Cecil? She got important. Wait, did I forget to give the full explanation? Everyone calls her Miss Geta La, La Primera because she's just that. She's the number one, even higher than us regular champions. She's the top champion. I do indeed hold that claim. Alongside my role as chairwoman of the Pokemon League, that is. I thought you were too busy to spend your time checking on the gems. I'm not here to inspect the gem. I've come to scout some rather promising young talent. Whoa, I look away for one second, you're fa and you're famous, Tesla? I don't know about that. But hey, I found Tesla first. Maybe you left Primera, but you can't stick can't go stealing her from me. <laughs> I suppose I'll have to get in line. That's right. Come on, Tesla, time for a battle. But I gotta heal first. One moment, please. Huh? What is it? I would very much like to observe this match if it's alright. Oh, <laughs> totally fine by me. Sounds fun, right, Cecil? Yes. Thank you kindly. I'm actually, I'm already excited to see you two face off. Can I heal first before you do that? Let's be on our way then. You're not gonna let me heal, are you? Little bitch. Little bitch. What a bitch! You remember how it all works, right? Once you get badges from all the gyms, you get to throw it down against the strongest Pokemon trainers around. Yes, you must face the Pokemon League. It's located northwest of, Mez of Mezagoza. Mezagoza. 
The Pokemon League is where trainers are reborn as champions, the greatest honor that they might dream of. Collecting eight bed gym badges sets you up to take on the champion assessment. If you can challenge, face the challenge of the final examiner and win, you'll become a champion. Just imagine how, how that moment would feel. Try getting into that champion mindset. Now set yourself on reaching that big, important stage, and let's battle. Excuse me one moment. The assess this Pokemon will still be a little bit fatigued. Yeah! Sorry, I got caught up in my battle hunger. Well, you should all be in good shape, great shape now, thanks to La Primera. Okay, so it's so time to put our game faces back on. All right. Nimona. I know that Primera's watching, but no need to get worked up. Just stay cool. Thanks, lady. Uh nah. oh, shit. That's all I got. Besides quick attack. I see a Pokemon center way up in the mountains over there. It's like a beacon. Gumi's supposed to be poison, so... Uh, okay. Bad matchup. Vaporeon, it's your time to shine with that, uh, Aurora Beam. Good thing, I, good thing I kept it. Oh, it's dragon. Thought it was poison. I wonder ice is more super effective against you. Oh, that was a good one. We really had some zing to it. Evolution of Palmy, so I definitely need to switch. I'm gonna put Flareon in for the dig. I haven't seen his final evolution yet, so I'm kind of curious to see what it looks like. Oh, wait. No, I've seen that. I thought it was something different. Never mind. Pokemon she had. All right, there's the final form of the of the of the starter. So, I mean, I've already seen what it looks like because of raids, but uh, for a video, I haven't seen it in the video. Wow, you seen this Primera? I'm getting backed into a corner. Quackerel. Dancing. No point ter terrestrializing because uh, none of my moves are gonna get boosted. Come to terrestrialize. Watch, I'm gonna make La Primera eyes light up. I bet you would.
Okay, I'm pulling all the stomps. Get ready, I want to see you stomp, stand up to this. Fancy. Alright. Then I got Magical Leaf. Now oh, you're still faster than me. Alright. It's just raising your fucking speed. That's a problem for me then. Alright. Do this! I observe your water shit! Ha! Don't for the slow grind of the water beam. Oh. Damn! She thought ahead. Oh, of course I flinched, actually. Two crits in a row? Alright, get out of here. The dancing duck. We're gonna start paying more and more attention to you. I just know it. An amazing display of talent, even against one of skill's champion Demona. That was a splendid match. I enjoyed watching very much. Now even La Primera thinks you're one to watch. You've got so much potential. The way you're going, I, be I better watch my my back. You know, since the first time we met, I've been weirdly sure of one thing. You're gonna become a champion, no doubt about it, Tesla. The rest of these gems? You can take them. 100% no problem. I agree. In fact, you should take this. Consider it an investment in your future. Terrablast. What's that? If the user has Terra Stellar, they only use energy of its Terra type. The moon inflicts damage using the attack or special attack stat. Whichever is higher for the user. Oh. It kind of sucks with me because since I, all my shit's normal. Hmm. Pokemon uses that move while Terra still The move's type will change the Terra type of the Pokemon. One day, Celsius, you and me are going to have the greatest battle of all. I know it. I'm going to go train up even more than I already have been. She showed you so much such support, support and friendship. Or perhaps. Perhaps she truly, she hopes you truly might rival her? No. I think it's no mere hope. She seems to have complete faith in that you will catch up to her. At any rate, let me return you to the gym where I found you. Thanks, lady. I mean, you didn't have to. Alright. Did it. Um, so yeah. Let's see where we're at in the map. Uh, I can't get to him yet, so obviously I gotta go through the mountains. And these things are level 50, so I don't want to even try attempting the, uh, the lake yet until I'm near that level. So I guess I'm going I'm gonna end it here, but I guess in the next part, maybe we'll try climbing the mountain and see how uh, take on these last these last few gems? Maybe? What is this? Gem. Gem Wow, they're so close together. Okay, there's the star badge. Alright, yeah. 
we'll do that. We'll climb the mountain. Maybe if I get to level 50, we'll do more uh, exploring off video. We'll tackle this. But we'll see what, where I'm at in the, in the next part. Uh, yeah, I don't, th I don't think we'll be tackling that in the next part because yeah, we're 38. So unless they gain 12 levels between now and Saturday, which I don't think will happen. But anyway, I will, I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next part. Later. Uh -oh.